Hi everyone and welcome back. I'm very excited today to share with you my Outlander inspired card. It's a card more for the male set. Um, it's Solangeva, which is a Gaelic Scottish um, saying meaning cheers or good health. Um, it's usually said during a drinking toast. So I wanted to make a card. Um, Outlander is one of my absolute favorite shows. Diana Gabaldon is absolutely uh, an amazing author. This card, the colors on the card as well, I, I tried to replicate the colors of the Outlander Scottish Tartan, which is more of the, the blue and the brown um, tones, which is the tones that I used for the background on the card. So here I'm drawing out a whiskey glass, uh, a small stout glass, um, just in a pencil drawing and um, penciling in um, ice cubes. I thought I'd put three ice cubes in here and try and replicate a glass half full with whiskey. Uh, just simple squares here, nothing fancy in terms of drawing. As usual, my drawings are very, you know, basic and um, and simple. I'm not doing a lot of shading. I'm going to be using uh, my colored pencils, water pencils, uh, to put the um, what looks like whiskey there. You can see now I'm marking out the line for the glass half full um, of the whiskey mark and um, just fine lining, fine, fine lining around the ice cubes and the glass itself. I put a little marks around the glass that look like water droplets within it. And you'll see when we finish this off, we're going to finish it off uh, so that it looks very uh, shiny and sparkly. So here I spray it with a little bit of water. I'm using my Artist Lofts um, pencils. They're watercolor pencils and outlining. Um, and this is, looks like a black, but it's really a light gray. We're going to be using Mod Podge, and I'll show you the Mod Podge Dimensional Magic um, that I'm going to be putting on with my finger, and that brightens up. This card looks so much better in person than it does in the video. The Mod Podge, when you look at the glass in the real card, it's very shiny and bright. It looks just like a glass. And I'll show you the technique and why I did the Mod Podge after I did my stamping with my Versamark ink. Um, <clears throat> so we're shading with the gray. We put the yellow, and I did I did yellow and um, I think a medium brown uh, for the whiskey, and shaded around the ice cubes. And I did use a little bit of white in the the ice cubes. For the blue, I want to use our distress inks here to go around and do. This reminds me of the. The blue in the tartan as well as the blue in the um, Scottish skyline, just the bright blue sky on the days that it is bright and, and sunny in Scotland. Uh, so we're using um, two distressed inks here. The first one I put down was the Salty Ocean and then I went around just lightly on the edge with the Chipped Sapphire. That chip sapphire just brought the edge of this piece out because I'm going to be placing it on a brown craft-like paper. Again, the colors of the tartan um, for Outlander anyways are um, the browns, the, the tone browns and the, the lighter blue. So I do three layers here and go ahead and we'll tape those down with our tape runner. I ran out of tape in the middle of it, so I just grabbed my double-sided tape. I love this Scotch tape runner. It's a very, very nice tape. It's easy to use. I think it's easier to manipulate and use the smaller Scotch tape runners than it is the ATC gun. I do go through them fairly fast, though. You'll see here. I'm sorry, I'm a little off screen here. I have a new video set up, so it's going to take a little bit of time for me to adjust it. And I switched to this the double-sided tape here. 
So this is more of a craft color um, paper that we put down. And, and then I will put the whiskey glass piece on top of that. And then we're going to put our Scottish saying, which they use a lot in Outlander to say um, toast. So, um, Slajman. And there is a video, and I forget who it's by on Outlander, and they talk about, or on YouTube, and they talk about um, Outlander speech lessons and with a Gaelic expert. And it's a stars video, I believe, that, that's up there. But it, it goes through some of the words that they use, some of the Gaelic words that are used um, in in Outlander, and that's it, a wonderful video series that I think it's sponsored by Stars. So here we're going to to be placing the letters on. I wanted to go into a curve again. This is more of a masculine card. I'm using my um, Versum Fine Ink in. I believe that's it's just a black Versamark ink. I use it a lot. It's Onyx Black or Neur Onyx. And the stamp I'm using did not stamp as um, clear as I wanted it to. So I do go back in with my um, prism pen and a, a fine tip black pen and fill that in so they're nice and dark um, in black since that is part of the the message is part of the main focal point of the, this card. Real simple card. I like doing it because I, I tend to do real female feminine cards and this has more of a masculine touch. I really liked it. Um, I love this saying. I love Again, I love Outlander and everything about it. So this is kind of a neat card for me to work on. Here we're taking the um, Dimensional Magic, putting just real thin layer all around. You can see I'm dotting it around and I'm using my fingers. I love using my fingers on some of this stuff because I just want a, a real thin layer on it. And I didn't want to do the glass with the Dimensional Magic before I stamped because the stamp would not have stuck to the Dimensional Magic. So the Versa, the Versa Fine ink would not have stuck um, as well. And it actually looks pretty good how I have it just on the base of the the whiskey glass there. I enjoyed sharing this with you. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Please subscribe and like if you um, would like to see more videos like this. Put comments below. Thank you so much and have a beautiful day.